again, turning around, looking back at the table. When we do some of our experiments later on, such as the metabolic experiment requiring blood draws, they will be done at this table. It's not only the place where we... we when we do some of our experiments later on, such as the metabolic experiment requiring blood draws, they will be done at this table. It's not only the place where we, we would eat but and do eat, but it's also the place which is very convenient for conducting things like uh, blood draws. So that is, in fact, where we'll center the metabolic experiment. Somewhere near Tasmania. This is the central control post of the base block of the original Mir station. We've already been flying here now, our crew, over 10 days, with almost three months left to go. This is a three-month flight. Most of the sh Russian flights are actually longer than that, significantly longer than that. You simply can't endure the kind of intensity over the course of months that you would do on a shuttle flight. If you're only up for a week or two, obviously you've got to make every minute count. And we train intensively and we fill every last minute. This is our Soyuz spacecraft. And if something happened that we had to abandon the station, we would go through there, get in the, in the uh, Soyuz and uh, undock and then come back to Earth. And there you have it. That's a run through. We, if we've got any time, uh, we'll stand by and see uh, what's